Well, hello, Harvest family. I can't tell you how much I have missed seeing you on Sunday morning. Uh, I really believe there's a reason the scripture says, do not forsake the assembling of yourselves together as the manner of some are, and even more so in the day that approaches. I'll be so glad when we get back together and I can see your faces on Sunday morning as we worship. I've been thinking about a few things in the past few weeks as we're in these unsettling times. Uh, there's a lot that we don't know about the future. And, you know, fear and doubt and unbelief are those things that when we are not sure, when we don't feel secure, they come rushing in and they try to take over our minds and our hearts. But, you know, every Sunday when we come here, we've been singing songs that describe the Lord, who he is, and it speaks to some of those things that he is faithful and that he is with us. And I just thought it would be good to remind us today about some of the songs that we sing. So many times we sing songs, but we do not hear what we're singing about. And those songs are filled with the truths of God's word and who he is. And they should bring a lot of settling to us in these unsettled times. So let me just share a few of those and uh, think about them as I sing these words. I raise a hallelujah in the presence of my enemies. I raise a hallelujah, fear you have no hold on me. It speaks of when we praise the Lord, we are, are lifting our eyes up to the God, the Father, who is faithful, and fear has to flee. How about this one? This is how I fight my battles. This is how I fight my battles. This is how I fight my battles. When I am surrounded, I'm surrounded by you. When it looks like I'm surrounded, I'm surrounded by you. And then how about this one? All my life you have been faithful. All my life you have been so, so good. With every breath that I am able, I will sing of the goodness of God. And then this last one. Tis so sweet to trust in Jesus, just to take him at his word, just to rest upon his promise, just to know, thus saith the Lord. Oh, these words mean so much when we start hearing them, not just listening to them, but hearing them and taking them in our heart and standing on them and resting upon them. So let me challenge you today and during the next few weeks as we press on in this time that what we sing, we mean in our hearts. We listen to the words and we give God the praise and the glory and the honor. He is faithful. Fear you have no hold on me. Hallelujah. Be encouraged this week.